A long time ago, there was an alien civilization called the Solanaki. Their species had reached the pinnacle of evolution and scientific advancement. Their society had transcended ego and they were on the brink of synthesizing infinite energy. All they needed to complete their infinity power station was a certain scarce resource, gold. So the Solanaki sent out their intergalactic gatherer fleet to search for gold and to mine it. One of their gatherer ships was the Yakko. While on their way, the Yakko was suddenly ripped out of hyperspace. They were lucky to survive, and even luckier to find a small blue planet where they could land and regroup. Stranded for months, their distress signals were met with nothing but silence. Analyzing all data, they reconstructed what happened. The Infinity Power Station exploded and destroyed the intergalactic gateways, and likely, their home planet. This meant the Yako's crew could be all that was left of the entire Solanaki civilization. And without any female crew members, extinction was imminent. Until one of them had a crazy idea. His plan was to teach and evolve one of the planet's native species. This evolved life form would later provide the workforce to build cosmic structures and maybe return home. This plan stretched over thousands of years, so they had to use forbidden technology and clone their best crew members. The clones would reclone periodically, while the crew would be preserved in a cryogenic slumber. And to make their millennia-long teaching job easier, the clones built robots in the image of their new students. And this is how it all began. <laughs>